Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel for another movie reaction. Today we are watching Airplane. So for a while now I have really been craving like a comedy. I just want to sit here, chill out, and just have a good laugh. I started asking what a good funny movie recommendation would be and on top of asking people and just doing my own research like quick google searches and all that, this movie Airplane came up on every single list. Every article, every person at one point mentioned this movie to me. I think it's just time that I jump in and finally watch this movie and see what all the hype is about. But more importantly, right now, I just need a good laugh and I hope you do too. I hope that's why you're here and I hope you enjoy the reaction and that it brings you some happiness today. Once again, just a gentle reminder that you're not going to have access to the full movie. If you want to just watch the movie yourself, absolutely, you can do that whenever the heck you want. You don't have to watch me watch it. I'm just here to react to Airplane for the first time, hopefully get in some really, really good laughs. If you guys find yourself enjoying this reaction, make sure to leave a thumbs up on the video at the very end. Oh, real quick before we jump in, I also just want to mention that I have heard that this movie is literal jokes. Like, that's it. It's just one after another after another after another. So, since this is my first time watching it, I just wanted to warn you that I may not pick up on some jokes right away, especially if it's like really quick and I'm laughing about something else. There might be things that I don't react to or maybe I just don't pick up on right away. Like, maybe there's some nuances. I don't know. I've never seen the movie. But just understand that it might take me a couple rewatches. And if I end up loving this movie, you can bet I'll probably watch it at least 10 times. All right, that's enough from me. So without further ado, let's jump in and finally watch Airplane. I just can't stop smiling at this already. Like I'm just ready to laugh. The Jaws theme. <laughs> no, 30 seconds into it, I'm already laughing. I am never gonna ride an airplane and go through clouds and be the same way ever again. <laughs> I'm always gonna be looking for the fin. The music's really good. But thank you anyway. He's like, bitch. Ugh. There is no stopping in the red zone. I'm gonna hear this in my sleep now. I'm gonna start reciting it. Listen, buddy, don't start off with your white zone shit again. <laughs> what? <laughs> Want me to have an abortion? It's really the only sensible thing to do. If it's oh my god! Beautifully, there's no danger involved. Their announcements turned into a therapy session. I feel like I really gotta pay attention. I'm sorry if the only commentary I have to add is just laughter. I feel like this humor is gonna be really smart and I'm really, I'm gonna miss, a lot's gonna go over my head. It's over there with the baggage loader. <gasps> oh no, he said Dunna, dunna, dunna. The plane went, here's Johnny. And I can't live with the man I don't respect. Just stab him with a dagger. <laughs> you might as well. <laughs> no way she just said that. Oh my gosh. Captain Clarence over. I've got it. Thank you. Thank you. at the Mayo Clinic. There's a passenger on your Chicago flight. Oh, it's actual I want you to make sure that she's kept in a reclined position <laughs> and that a continuous watch is kept on her IV. As he's not watching it. <laughs> All right, give me ham on five. Hold the mail. <laughs> this movie is too much. This is too- I am already loving this movie. Hold the mayo. That I can't. That was- that was it. You had me at hold the mayo. <laughs> I'm going to start my life all over again. I'm sorry. Ooh. Church of religious conscience. Ooh. <laughs> Is she gonna respect him by the edge? <laughs> People falling is always funny. Elaine Dickinson is on this flight. 
Well, the uh, whole flight crew. Okay, dude. Like maybe just let it go. No baggage. No baggage. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Are you sure? Smoking or non-smoking? Smoking, please. Smoking on an airplane, man. Have a nice trip. <laughs> the literal humor, the physical humor is amazing. Because you're thinking about one joke that they just made and all of a sudden they throw another one at you and you're just like, I have joke whiplash. Side down his head, you know? Hey, home, I can dig it. There's subtitles? Cole got to be. Yo, <laughs> shit. I can't, I just real, I just learned, I cannot listen and read at the same time. <laughs> smoking or not smoking? Wait, so if he sat in the smoking section, where's everyone else's smoking tickets? Why is the whole plane not just enveloped in smoke? First time. No, I've been nervous lots of times. <laughs> It's not where you expect it to go. This is so exciting. I know, but remember, you must get some rest. I feel like this is going to be very not exciting in about two minutes. Send me one, all right? Okay, here, hurry. This is giving me anxiety. Watching him. No, that is. It <laughs> Airplanes don't work like this. <laughs> oh, my God. Clarence, over. Over. Roger. Huh? Roger. Roger. Huh? <laughs> Clarence, Clarence. Roger, Roger. What's our vector, Victor? <laughs> That's so funny. Famous Jewish sports legends. Yes. That's very specific. I don't have time now. Oh, Stuart is. Excuse me. She's like, I'm working. You literally came to my job. Red flag? It's a shame you two don't get long. Yes, I know. Is she real, or is she just his thoughts? Cuz... It was during the war. I was in the Air Force, stationed in Drambui, off the Barbary Coast. She's like, that was not an invitation! Fight breaking out almost every night. Between Girl Scouts? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> This fight is going on extremely long. Ah! <laughs> is this staying alive? You're kidding. What is this movie? And why am I just now watching this? Oh, I know why. It's because I would not have got any of this as a kid. really trying to stay alive. <laughs> Someone died. Here's my chance. Oh my goodness. It, it, oh my god. It, it <laughs> he looks like one of the dudes from the actual band. I'm pretty sure that's how they used to dress, right? I can look him up. Oh, I'm gonna guess the band. Bee Gees? I... I'm so sorry if that's wrong. I'll take- I'll take that. That's- that's on me. Dude, he can dance though. Honestly. I'm always the most awkward dancer at like weddings and stuff. Like I just can't do it. I'm gonna start stealing this. They're still fighting. <sighs> that was fantastic. That was so funny. Hey, I hope this hasn't been boring for you. It's just that whenever I start to talk about Lane, I always get so carried away. Oh my! I want you to stand. These two kids, do they hold steady jobs? Like... I take it black. Like my man. <laughs> oh, not what I was expecting. Reminds me of the beginning of Greece. Even the song. Is that the point? Is this the is that the point of it? Oh, I can't tell you that. It's classified. But that wasn't classified, the literal plans? 
that he just stole her? She gives me Sandy from Grease vibes. That's, that's what it was. I, I couldn't place it, but this scene. Yep. Olivia Newton-John could have had this role too. I mean, good gosh. You can stay here for a while if you'd like. Could I? No. Got season tickets. I think you should go back to your seat now, Joey. Yeah, I think that's a great idea. You like movies about gladiators? That dude's weird. <laughs> like it was in the beginning, remember? <laughs> Me drowning you. Seven Lieutenant Zip died this morning. <laughs> oh my god! Dr. Sandler says she'll be out in a week. Isn't that wonderful? She has terrible bedside manners. A little bedroom with mirrors on the ceiling and... Red leader! Red leader! I'm going down! Why? Oh. Oh. What's his world? I don't know if I want to know. Thinks he's Ethel Merman. You'll be swell. You'll be great. Gonna have the whole world on a plate. Start here. <laughs> Start it now. The every <laughs> As a musical person, I appreciated that so much. <laughs> it's <was> actually her. <laughs> I will, but Jim won't. I think I will have another cup of coffee. Like the hell I won't. If I talk to your daughter, well, I think that'd be nice. Don't you mean sing to your, to your daughter? Old and the hungry, and I saw that <laughs> there is only one river. Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh! This amazing blowout performance. It, <laughs> I was waiting for it to happen. Probably start to bore you. You know, I really couldn't oh! blame Elaine. She wanted a career. He's <laughs> he's gonna talk all of his plane partners to death. I can find some drama, mean. You know what? Two people have already died on this airplane so far. I'm sorry I have to wake you. You were doctor. That's right. Uh, what gave it away? <laughs> I just happened to have this thing on me. Let me see your tongue. Uh, uh, uh. An egg? Yeah. Did you say he was a doctor or a magician? I, I... I'll be back in a minute. She's like, you forgot one! Victor, we're running into some heavy weather. Can you... Third person down. I can't remember if that's Victor. I think that's Victor. <laughs> He's like, oh crap, I don't actually know how to fly a plane. Wait, what? So they're all sweating. Somebody's puking eggs. Something going around. Oh my god, this is like my greatest fear. I can't. No. No. Even turbulence, the most terrifying thing. I can't. It's nothing to be alarmed about. We'll be back to you very quickly. What she means to say is you're next. <laughs> She's like, you're done for. It's it. We'll become violently ill in the next half hour. Thank God the doctor had lasagna. <laughs> Oh! Oh! I just love that the whole time you never know what to expect. You never know what they're gonna say, show, or do next. It's glorious. It's dropping fast! Oh, because- Why is it doing that? Because your pilot is deflating. <laughs> Pull it out and blow on it. She's gotta reinflate it. Placement. Oh, oh no! <laughs> oh. <laughs> the balloon did that on purpose. They're both smoking. <laughs> They're both smoking. 
I can't. Oh my gosh. Can you face some unpleasant facts? No. <laughs> no. Well. Oh no, not his drinking problem. But who didn't have fish for dinner? I know of one person. <laughs> oh! <laughs> wow! <laughs> But as I say, they didn't have time to tell me very much. Uh. Um, ma'am, your dog? Are you a pilot yourself? No, I'm in. Oh! All right, let's get out of here. They just don't care. This man is getting mauled in their living room. It's fine. Drainage in mine. So oh. we had to take a special jeep. He claims his third victim. <laughs> well, I flew in the war, but it was years ago. Oh, no. I wouldn't know anything about it. Let me tell you about it. He's go please go to life or death situation now. Surely you can't be serious. I am serious. And don't call me Shirley. <laughs> that would, I don't know how they do it. That, looking at that every day would give me such anxiety. I would want to have like five backup people, backup pilots. <laughs> the picture behind him. Oh, that's funny. Mixture, wash, soak, rinse, spin. Repeat. Oh my god. Oh no, not the nun. There's just a line of a people. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. No. Oh. How about Buddhism? Just busted through all the world's religions. <laughs> you ever flown a motor engine plane before? No, never. Shit. <laughs> so way you can land this plane. Hold on to yourself. You gotta talk about. It. You gotta. So about that confidence. <laughs> oh. Oh. One no more thing. Somebody there who can work the radio and leave. <laughs> Is ill. <laughs> Slightly ill. But the other two pilots. Oh, he's lying. <laughs> oh, the subtle Pinocchio reference. So funny. Bone, take me up. Take me. Do you have fish too? Blood. She's gonna catch up on the rebound on the med side. What it is, big mama. My mama didn't raise no dummies. I duck her rap. Cut me some slack, Jack. Jump and run a help, chop, don't get the hell. Say can't hang, say seven up. Jive ass dude don't got no brains in it. That was so... <laughs> oh, that was amazing. Well, I could make a cap, or a brooch, or pterodactyl. Um. I don't know how they didn't crack up more. They probably did. I would love to see the bloopers of this movie, because... I would not have been able to keep a straight face. We don't know how serious it is yet, but Steve McCroskey thought you'd- Oh, they, uh, uh, what? <laughs> I w- <laughs> I, I have no words. I, I just, I have no words. It's impossible, they're on instruments. <laughs> Looks like I picked the wrong week to quit amphetamines. Yeah. <laughs> He was on everything. But he's an experienced Air Force pilot who flew during the war, so there's no- Is someone holding an ice cream cone? <laughs> Boy trapped in refrigerator eats own foot? <laughs> I say, let him crash. I say, let him crash. <laughs> Not. Gonna say pretty judgy, huh? And then I think I like this version better. <laughs> oh, he does not like it though. <laughs> Besides, I'm 26 and I'm not married. Uh, we're going to make it. You've got to believe that. Dr. Rumack, do you have any idea when we'll be landing? Pretty soon. How are you bearing up? Well, to be honest, I've never been so scared. No. 
But at least I have a husband. Oh, oh, too soon, too soon. <laughs> It's just like riding a bike, right? Yeah, look at that. Yeah. And Leon's getting larger. <laughs> that guy is so weird. I would really get that checked out. That won't smell too good, that's for sure. It won't, it won't smell too good. I've got a plane to land. And thank you for not calling him Shirley. Airline negligent. There's a sale at Penny's. <laughs> News travels fast. The tower, Rapunzel, Rapunzel. He had the best role. <laughs> oh, what a wonderful movie to watch on a plane. It's like when my parents made me watch Jaws before we went on our first cruise ship or the Titanic. Yeah, it happened. You don't know where that finger's been. <laughs> what? Ah! Ah! Zero, four, four. Oh, he's playing a game. Whatever you like, you can get poured onto that field. You ain't done right now. Oh, that's... <laughs> the literal humor. Oh. Air Force positions number four and five. Budweiser, yep. Israel, please clear the runway. Oh my god, it had a beard. <laughs> it had facial hair. I was like, what is that? Oh, where disco lives forever. <gasps> I love disco. What is that supposed to mean? <laughs> Hating on disco. Oh. I'm very proud. And you have my respect. We ought to turn on the searchlights now. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Use your emergency brakes. Red handles right in front of you. She's feeling them up. <sighs> How many takes did that take, though? Like, seriously. Genuine question. Looks like I picked the wrong week to quit sniffing blue. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. That's what did him in. Do not try that at home. <laughs> Below 700 now, it's still going down. 675. <laughs> He's just doing laundry that's so funny. <laughs> just kidding. J <laughs> Keep your eyes on the far end of the runway. I will never become a pilot. That's all I'm learning from this. World! Landing is always the hardest part for me. This, this I always brace. I can't help it. A break! Pull the red handle! Oh my god! Ah! No! Again, worst fear ever. Ah! The brake's not working. Oh god. <laughs> oh! Again. Again, new fear unlocked. Thanks. Thank you. Never thought about that a day in my life, and now I will. Actually, you know what? This is fine. It stopped. I just want to tell you both. Good luck. We're all counting on you. Good luck. <laughs> oh my goodness. Have a nice day. Thank you for flying Transamerica. Yeah, I want a refund. Oh my god, the poor girl. I totally forgot about her too. Have a nice day. <laughs> And she still didn't finish her makeup. Such a shame. That's that's the real travesty here. Again, I'm getting Grease vibes. They're just not on a beach. Well, this is the greatest get back together story I have ever seen. What? The real hero. Oh! That was hilarious. Hilarious. I, I don't know her name. I need to know her name. Julie Haggerty as Elaine. This movie was so fantastic.
I honestly don't even know where to start with this movie. I have seen a lot of comedies, but I cannot believe how quick and constant every single joke delivery was. This movie needs minimum two, three rewatches because I'm sure I missed some things as I was watching that for the first time that if I watched it again, I'd be like, I didn't even pick up on that joke or I didn't understand the reference or what have you. I have to watch this again. This is without a doubt one of the funniest movies I have ever seen. It was like an entire comedy show, just a sketch after sketch after sketch, joke after joke after joke, and it just wouldn't let off. I swear you had to be paying attention the entire time or you were going to miss something. Which is probably why I feel like I gave almost no commentary, no like verbal commentary besides laughter because I just was so intent on trying to pick up on everything. But at least I hope you can tell that I enjoyed that so much. I now understand why it is constantly listed and rated as one of the top five, but it's mostly been top three. Like, I don't think there's a single article or list that I have seen on Google that has not placed this movie in the top three. And now I get why the writing, the jokes, the physical comedy was so on point. Going back to one of the jokes that, that came up a couple times, the Shirley joke. They turned something that you would have never thought could ever become a joke into one of the funniest jokes in the movie. But I would also like to mention that I've been on planes many, many, many times in my life, and I don't remember a single instance where being on a plane was a fun and enjoyable experience, and somehow this movie has given me exactly one enjoyable experience with an airplane. So thank you for that. I have got to look up and see if there's any videos out there where there's bloopers for this movie, like the actors trying trying so hard to say their lines and then they just can't because they can't stop cracking up. I found myself thinking that almost the entire movie because so much of it was like them really close together and just delivering these hilarious lines, like touching each other how did they not, how did they get through the filming of this movie? I could, I would not have been able to keep a straight face. And this definitely gave me the laugh that I so desperately needed. And thank you to everyone who has at some point recommended this movie to me. I finally can join in with all the references now. I feel so special. I know every comedy is different and some of my favorite comedy movies are like, more recent, I would say, like, Pitch Perfect, Bridesmaids is still, to this day, one of the funniest movies I've ever seen. But this is nice because this is a one-of-a-kind movie. I have never quite seen anything like this. It was clearly not meant to be taken seriously. There was, like, a lot of little jokes here and there, like, satire on so many things. It made a lot of references to, like, little things that we deal with on a daily basis, like, little annoyances, too. It's just, it was so genius. So going forward now, in, like, any of my videos for any of my channels, if someone ever says Shirley, and I say, don't call me Shirley, <laughs> At least now, I will be able to make that joke and know exactly where it's from. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really hope you enjoyed this reaction. I so enjoyed this movie, and I really hope you were able to laugh along with me. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and click the bell button as well to get notified for all future movie reactions. I definitely have a huge backlog of movies, of really well-known ones, just old ones that I've never seen before that I cannot wait to get to and share with you guys here on the channel. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and I hope this movie and this video is a reminder to you to laugh as much as you can because already after watching this and having laughed almost the entire freaking time, I just feel so much better. Once again, have a wonderful day and I'll see you guys in the next video.